helping your clients achieve the results they want without surgery or toxic injections. Is it possible? You will see for yourself after reviewing Alina's treatment protocols. Alina Fedotova is president of the Association of Holistic Skin Care Practitioners, CEO of Alina Natural Transdermal Bioenergized Skin Care Products, a cosmetic chemist, educator, herbalist, and esthetician who develops corrective holistic skin care techniques and products. For more than a decade, she continues to formulate and hand make her own organic skin care line. It is available through exclusive skin care clinics in the United States and other countries around the world. Alina's products are also on the list of Campaign for Safe Cosmetics. In order to formulate effective products, she works directly with clients two days a week. She continues to give corrective holistic facial treatments in her clinics and creates specialty formulas. Alina founded the Association of Holistic Skin Care Practitioners to make a distinction between professionals who are temporarily beautifying the surface by using questionable quick fixes and the others who improve the skin as part of an entire balanced body using an effective healthy approach. The Association created educational programs for professionals and consumers about the latest research on non-invasive methods. It also provides information on safe natural ingredients for corrective anti-aging and anti-inflammatory skin treatments. You can get more on this from the following website, holisticskincarepractitioners.org. In addition, health professionals and estheticians around the country are trained by Alina about the benefits of holistic skin care treatments. Being a, a holistic practitioner, I need to treat the inside as well as the outside. And that's where Alina's products have been so helpful. So many people are doing green products and with global warming, I think that's all just sort of coming to our consciousness and it's coming to a part of people being more conscious about their choices that they're making, whether it be recyclable materials or what they put on their skin, their skin absorbs. Our skin is the largest organ of the body. Very important that we respect and take care of that organ. Thank you very much for choosing my skincare product line. Uh, today, uh, we're going to work on treatments which you're going to perform for your clients in professional treatment room. During each treatment protocol, you will use tea with anti-inflammatory healing herbs and fruits. Of course, every facial starts with proper cleansing. And um, in my protocols, cleansing always will include vacuuming. We will start cleansing with application of cleanser um, appropriate for skin type cleanser for oily skin or cleanser for dry complexion and after that um, I will vacuum her skin and lots of estheticians never vacuum because they don't really see a uh, value in that procedure but it's absolutely incredibly important to do that it's the same way like you have to vacuum the carpet to call it to call it clean it's not enough just to pick at that the same thing you have to do it for skin because you can't extract every single pore and to call the skin clean and make it ready for application of treatment products we have to vacuum the uh, skin so i will demonstrate cleansing vacuuming and extractions which would be similar for every single skincare protocol and only difference in that would be uh, if uh, with application of cleanser it could be cleanser for oily skin or dry Let's start. We brewing the tea first. And I have my professional coffee or teapot with tea in it, um, which could be made out of different herbs, dandelion root, calendula, rose hips. We, you can mix different blends of tea appropriate for skin types. And I brew the tea, which I will use instead of water, to clean the skin and mix my powdered masks with. So this is a comfortably warm tea, which I'm going to use for cleansing. 
Alina will use a cleanser appropriate for skin type. Instead of toxic ingredients like sodium lauryl sulfate, Alina uses polyglycoside, an all-natural ingredient, along with special blends of healing herbs. It gently and safely cleanses the skin and is even safe enough to use around the delicate eye area. I will choose wider uh, attachment for vacuuming, which has a hole in it. Uh, some attachments don't have a hole. You don't have to close the hole to create a suction. Uh, with all of those attachments, which has a holes in them, to really create a suction, you have to close the hole with your finger. And that's where you can control the airflow. When vacuuming, always follow the direction of the lymph flow. If the skin gets dry during the vacuum process, use a steamer to moisten it. Vacuuming is very important in the cleansing process because you cannot perform an extraction on every single pore, but every pore can accumulate excessive sebum and environmental pollutions. During vacuuming, you can also bring more blood flow into deep lines to stimulate the area to achieve a wrinkle reduction effect. Next step after we vacuum the skin, it's extraction. Because we picked up lots of impurities by vacuuming, but some stubborn areas still there. So we will use extractor, or some institutions use different manual techniques. I don't really pressure you to change your style. I just would like to make sure you will do safe and professional extraction. Even if we use um, sanitizers and autoclave, um, and our uh, instruments are always clean and sanitized. Right before I touch the skin with that, I still will use natural ethyl alcohol, grain alcohol, organic alcohol, 70%, to spray on it to make sure like no airborne bacteria fly around it. When doing extractions, spray a cotton ball or pad with alcohol to keep it clean. You'll use the cotton to collect impurities during the extraction process. Make sure the alcohol does not touch your client's skin, which can cause drying. Alina uses a spoon collecting technique to extract impurities from the skin, which is effective and gentle on the skin. During this process, be very careful so you don't break any capillaries. Alina will complete the cleansing part of the facial with an application of antiseptic oil control formula and high frequency treatment. Of course, it takes a longer time to properly clean and extract an oily complexion compared to dry. However, all skin types need vacuuming before the treatment protocol. <laughs>